another Valentine's Day book tag video. If I'm remembering this correctly, my very first book crush was the boy from A Wrinkle in Time. I'm pretty sure his name is Calvin. I might be wrong on that. But I just remember because he kisses Meg at the end, and it was the first time that I was like, oh, I have feelings when my favorite characters get together. It was like early shipping before shipping was a thing. But yeah, he was my first book crush. <laughs> oh, young Margot having so many memories. Oh. Um, I'm gonna go with A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J. Moss for this one because it is sexy. So yeah, I would totally love this one as my Valentine. I'm just gonna keep doing this until it's really uncomfortable for you. Neither donuts. <laughs> donuts in the shape of heart, obviously. <laughs> I would gift Gone Girl by Gillian Flynn because I'd give it to my true love and be like, hey, let's not do what they do in this book. This is a terrible example of a relationship. So let's just read it and do the exact opposite of what they do. Okay? <laughs> this book is so messed up. Um, my favorite rom-com is Cry Baby starring Johnny Depp. Um, it's a John Waters movie. If you haven't seen it, it's like this weird musical that's like set in the 50s and it's like good girls versus the greasers and it's sort of like a really weird Grease like version of Grease. It's like the John Waters version of Grease. But I remember because that was like the first movie that I had seen Johnny Depp in and I was like, oh, ha ha hot, so hot. And there's like a lot of kissing in it. And I was just like totally into that when I was growing up. And even now, love it. You guys should definitely watch it. What is the best Valentine's Day gift you've ever received? Um, I got dumped on Valentine's Day when I was 15. And I'm gonna say that was the best gift I ever received because that guy was a loser. So thanks for dumping me because then I moved on. I actually hate Valentine's Day. I think this, val this day sucks, but I get why other people like it. So if it makes other people happy, then that's my favorite thing about Valentine's Day. But since I don't really like it, I usually just do like a, my own version of Galentine's Day. You know, hang out with friends and stuff and be like, ooh, love sucks, Ugh, boys are stupid. <laughs> and now it's time to tag some people. I tag Kira Cass, Victoria Aveyard, Sasha Alsberg, YA bookworm blogger, and Little Book Owl. I can't wait to see your videos. And if I don't tag you, I really hope you still post a video and tell us in the comments so I can check it out and give it a thumbs up and give it all the hearts and hugs because it's Valentine's Day and everything is so lovey and romantic and I love all of you. Oh my God, I love you. Ah, oh, internet hugs. Oh.